All right, guys, this is Fabio Durello from BJJ Club. I'm in Auckland, New Zealand, the city of sales, right? Oh, Renato, wow. we are here at Tukaha BJJ from Pedro Pacheco, our good friend. And Renato's gonna show you guys a really nice pass. Is that right? When you, the guy uh, uh, on the bottom has the, the knee shield. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. So the technique is when uh, I'm trying to go for the knee slice pass, and the guy is doing a really good job with the knee shield, with yeah. his foot a little bit kind of close to my hip here. And I cannot beat that knee shield, right? Good. So that we're gonna do here, we're gonna switch this grip to the collar there and kind of stuff his shoulder down so he can reach my leg. And now that hand gonna go to his foot on my hip. You just right? grab the foot like this. Yeah, just here. grab the foot like that. Yeah. Really simple way to grab here. Okay? No grips on the pants. Nah. All okay. right. And then with this position, I'm gonna put a little bit pressure on the knee with my chest. So now when I'm here, I'm not gonna move my upper body too much. I'm just gonna switch my knees up just enough to push his foot in between my legs. Once his foot go, I break back. He's mashing his knees together and controlling the hip, the lower back here so he doesn't hip skate. Yeah. Right? From here, I'm gonna start putting pressure and the pass actually is gonna depend on his reaction. The reaction I get the most here is the guy try to square up his hip and get a half guard. Uh, yeah. So I'm just gonna long step Okay, really close to the hip. Okay, switch my hips and uh, the guy the guy sees that leg and he wants to catch the leg and go to the half. Yes, right exactly. That's one way to recover that. So I long step, I keep nice and tight to the hip, and then I come up on my knees rolling him a little bit here. I stick to the hip. If he rolls, we have the back. If he doesn't, we stay really nice, nice and tight on the side. Control. Let's do it again. I'm getting the knee slice pass here, he's using his uh, reverse de la here, but yeah. he should. It's hard to beat that, it's hard to come through. I'm gonna switch my grips, one go for the collar, kind of under his armpit, to yep. stuff his yeah. shoulder down. Pinching my, my shoulder down. To yeah. the mat, yeah. It's important to avoid letting him get in the leg there, yeah. so I kind of step my leg away. And then the hand goes to the, the ankle, right? right yeah, to the, to the ankle, just above the ankle here. Right. I noticed that you apply the pressure all the time here, even though you're switching your hips, you still have the pressure with your chest. Yes, exactly. My goal is to try to keep your knee in place and just move your foot in between my legs. Good. So I put my chest on top of the knee and I apply some pressure. Usually the guy even stiff his legs a little bit to try to make yeah. space. Now my chest is stay, I just switch my hips and my knees. On. Push down and go back. Once I go back, the hand goes to the hip, so he doesn't hip escape and I start applying pressure right to one of the common reaction he tried to from here I, I would do two things I either I will just try to grab that that leg to go to the half guard or I will put my hips in to try to recompose and do and play guard again yeah and then as soon as he moves his hip I'm out on the side okay that's really good keep nice and tight on the hips here and then throw him over a little bit to get on the knees and get to side control. Really good. Whoosh. Whoosh. Um, I saw that you, that first grip on the on the collar, on the lapel, helps you to keep the pressure the whole time. Come here, please. Uh, yeah. To keep the pressure the whole time, yeah? Yeah. When you're switching. Yeah. You're switching so here. the... You, you apply the pressure exactly. here. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Now my knee is stuck. My knee doesn't really yeah. move much. And this one, Keeps the pressure the whole time. Yeah. Yeah. Pulling the guy close Pulling to the guy. Yeah. yeah. Sort of stuffing the shoulder and pulling yourself close to the pressure as well. Very good. Thus, um, it's okay. The the lapel, the, the knee, the knee shield, and the the, the reverse of Hiva, they're really annoying situations. Sometimes yeah. when the guy is on the bottom trying to pass. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Sometimes the guys do a really good job with his knee pushing away, yeah. and he cannot beat the knee and come inside like you you'd like to. Yeah, with so the elbow in, but you cannot do this. So and you then switch you over to the other side. To avoid that pressure. Exactly, that, that yeah. So you get out of the fight. Get out of the fight, yeah. yeah. Awesome, yeah. awesome. I love nice. it. Nice. Hope you guys enjoy it. That's Renato. You are in uh, Tukaha from uh, Pedrinho Pedro Pacheco. Tukaha yeah. BJJ in Auckland, New Zealand. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting the channel. And give us a like below. I'll see you in the next video. Ooh. Hey guys, don't forget. Give us a like and leave a comment below. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, do it right now. This way you get updated with our most recent content and you will be supporting BJJ throughout the world. Peace.